if you're wearing a condom because I have a dirty mind. <laughs> What's going on YouTubers? It's the kid here from the Kids Corner and today I got a special unboxing as you can see by the title but first I'm just going to tell you guys that the audio is being recorded by the Audio-Technica ATR3350 Lavalier Omnidirectional Microphone uh, so you guys can get another audio test sample of what this microphone has to offer but enough of that let's get to the actual product itself and what I'm actually going to be unboxing today is the lens baby and I'm not going to actually tell you guys well anyways I'll just tell you right now it's the lens baby composer so um, lens baby was kind enough to send this over to me for review so thank you very much guys uh, for sending that over to me and if you guys want to read you can sit here and pause the video and read that nothing really on the back except for the skew and on this side is some more um, writing so anyways let's get actually into the goodies here and then I also have another unboxing along with this video so when you open up the front cover you are met with the lens baby composer right at the top and it's kind of weird it looks like how'd they get it in there but all you do is you pull it straight up and it opens up kind of like a uh, like a man-eating flower type deal but here is the lens baby composer in all of its glory it is beautiful this thing is very well made um, and it just it feels really really good um, it is very lightweight which is nice and it should be because it, there really isn't too much to this uh, plastic aluminum and a couple or just one lens insert but there are multiple lens optics you can put in here anyways um, being all manual focus manual aperture um, it is something that I'm really really wanting to um, you know explore and see my creative side so let's see what else is in this box if I can actually get in here without destroying it um, so let's pull this out and there's one more or there's two more things so I'm gonna pop this guy off to the side and here's some desiccant do not eat this it will make you really sick and you can die so I'll put that right back in there actually if we can get it in there there we go and here first is the aperture ring set and magnet that is included with the composer now basically you pop this cover off and you are um, given a variety of different aperture settings so you have to manually set your aperture to whatever you want so this first ring is f2.8 the next one that's on the lens itself is f4 the next one is 5.6 and so on and so forth f8 f11 f16 and f22 um, and basically it gives you a nice little storage case and I'll actually get to it right now mine as well um, we'll just take off the lens cover but you pop this little top off here and you are met with a little magnet on the tip and basically you can see um, hopefully you guys, yeah you guys can see there the f4 uh, and you can see the ring and basically all you do is you come down and you touch the aperture ring and you can pop it out simply like that and you can replace it with anyone you want and simply just drop it in and there is your f4 reinserted so it's simple it is held in by magnets on the actual lens itself so that's how it stays nice and sturdy and you can pop it out by tapping the lens uh, with a little bit of force nothing that will damage it but um, if you don't want to use the magnet you can actually go uh, buy it by a different route here is the manual for the lens itself and yes when I first looked at this I was like mama what well, what is that but lens baby baby mama I, I get it now but yeah I thought that was pretty cool a um, little ingenious little uh, I guess dry humor you would say but here's a little thing specifically for my Sony um, a55 that I will be doing test footage and the review on it at a later date and the rest of the lens manual and the optic swap system 
So that's nice. I'm gonna read through that. And here is a simple carrying case, pouch, thingy, whatever you want to call it. Um, just simply pop your guy in there and away you go. So there you go. So we're gonna pop this off to the side here and I'm actually gonna bring in the second part of this and Lens Baby was also kind enough to send me over their optic kit. So what you get in this optic kit is the plastic optic, the pinhole slash zone plate, and single glass optic and you basically get a tube of them and you can pop them out one by one and get all three hopefully I can get it to come out there we go and you get all three right there good to go so first I'm just gonna go through one of these um, because basically they're the same inside just obviously it's a different type of lens and I'll go with the single glass optic because that one is the one that interests me the most if I were to actually purchase this kit um, I would go with the single glass optic as an accessory so when you pop this open you are met with this little case and you are met with a manual for the optic swap system and how to change out the optic and all that good stuff but it's relatively simple um, and is very quick to do um, and the cap itself which is nice has the actual key to uh, switch out the optic so as long as you have an optic in its case you can switch them out with relative ease so um, I'll show you how to do that in a second but let's pop out the um, single glass optic and it is color coded so you know which one you have and it is also branded um, I don't know if you guys can see that but it says single glass and lens baby on this side so it's pretty nice so we'll pop that here for a second and in the bottom you are met with a little green microfiber cloth to wipe off your lens and whatever um, you need to wipe down uh, on your camera or rig or whatever so let's pop that back down to the bottom and I will show you how to quickly change out um, this guy so I guess it's a unboxing slash quick how to so anyways what you want to do is make sure that the lens is fully um, focused um, I want to say that's what is that to its closest macro um, and then you can see by the two dots here so what you want to do is take the three prongs on your cap and line them up in each one of the holes and then you're going to twist it till it comes to the open position so I'm basically let's see if I can get this on camera for you guys um, basically you're just going to put it down and it's in there and just give it a little twist and no pressure needed just a little bit and then pop and now it is unlocked and I can actually drop out the optic and this is the double glass that you are given with the system and same thing I'm not going to actually swap them but what you want to do is just um, line up the teeth on the back of the optic onto the little openings or the locking mechanism so you want to just drop that in and you'll know obviously that's not in so you just want to drop it and it will be almost flush um, and then you take the cap and you do the exact opposite you put it into the grooves and twist it the opposite way and the optic is now locked in place and it's not going anywhere and I'll show you real quick you can pop out the aperture ring just like that and there's no damage to the actual lens itself which is nice so if you guys are interested or, or have any questions please let me know in the comment section below uh, and stay tuned for my review and some test shots and footage of this whole system with a variety of lenses and optics that I've uh, been you know kindly given by lens baby and stay tuned for more good stuff and once again thank you guys from lens baby for giving me the opportunity to do this review and I will catch you guys next time thanks for watching